this hour of the night? <sighs> ah, the triumphant hero returns at last. And to a rather spectacular welcome, even if I do say so myself. You're the outcast, expelled from the academia. Indeed I am. Although these days they tend to call me the Doctor. If you're looking for your researcher friend, she has already been taken into confinement. With some basic caution, she could have discovered the listening device on her person. Clearly, she lacks the degree of rigor expected of a true scholar. The people of Samir City! What have you done to them? I simply made some minor adjustments to their Akasha terminals. Now they can deposit information directly into the subconscious. As you can see, all these lovely people now believe this traveler is a hero who has just saved the world. <laughs> My experiment is a success. And now it seems they can no longer hold back their sheer adoration. What should we do? These are all just regular people! Leave now. You need to get out of here. But that guy's a Fatui Harbinger! We can't just leave you here! Nor can I abandon the people of Samaru! appear to have overridden their mental faculties with your own consciousness. To possess such a powerful mind, you must be... the God of Wisdom. <sighs> this should be far enough. Paimon needs to catch her breath first. Uh, is the Hida going to be okay? We only made it out because of her. Paimon wasn't counting on running into a new Harbinger here, let alone such a high-ranking one. That guy was number two. So scary. Mm, he called himself the Doctor. Remember, Tainari told us about him. Sataria did say that someone who once got expelled from the Academia came back recently. And that even the Sages are wary of him. Yep, sounds like she must have been talking about the Doctor. Yeah, now that the Doctor's in the picture, we're no longer just dealing with the Academia. They're in cahoots with the Fatui. But what are the Fatui after this time? Another Gnosis? Yeah, things would be a lot easier with Nahida's help. Nahida said we'll meet again outside of the city. But we can't just keep waiting around, right? Uh, you mean... Oh, right! Wasn't he invited by the sages to work on some project when we were staying with him in the Vidya Forest? That has to be the same project. Even though he turned it down at the time, he might still know something. There's no time to lose. Let's go to Gundarvaville. 